Ever heard of autophagy? It's that cellular detox process everyone's talking about, especially when it comes to fasting. But with over 2025 new studies expected on this topic alone, it's getting hard to separate the science from the social media hype. Is autophagy just another wellness fad, or is there real substance behind it? Let's break it down Q&A style. First question, what even is autophagy? Think of it as your body's internal Marie Kondo. It's a natural cellular cleanup process. Your cells create these tiny specialized garbage disposals that go around collecting old, damaged, or junk parts, like misfolded proteins or worn-out organelles. They then break them down and recycle them for energy or to build new, healthy cell components. It's not just about cleaning, it's about renewing. This process is happening in your body right now, but certain things can seriously ramp it up. So next question. Is fasting the only way to trigger it? This is a huge myth. Fasting, especially intermittent fasting or prolonged fasts of over 16, 18 hours, is definitely a powerful way to induce autophagy. When your body is in a fasted state, it's not getting external energy, so it cleverly turns inward and starts recycling its own junk for fuel. It's a survival mechanism, but it's not the only way. Intense exercise, think high-intensity interval training or a long, strenuous workout, can also kickstart the process. Your muscles get stressed and autophagy steps in to repair and clean up the damage, making them stronger. Even certain foods rich in compounds like spermidine found in mushrooms and aged cheese or Resveratrol and red grapes can give it a gentle nudge. Okay, so what are the actual proven benefits? Is it a miracle cure-all? Let's be real, nothing is a miracle cure, but the science behind autophagy is incredibly promising. The 2016 Nobel Prize in Medicine was awarded for discoveries about its mechanisms, which tells you this is serious business. Research links enhanced autophagy to a whole host of potential benefits. It's crucial for brain health, helping to clear out the protein plaques associated with neurodegenerative diseases like Alzheimer's. It plays a role in managing inflammation, supporting a stronger immune system, and it's even being studied for its potential to slow down the aging process and protect against certain types of cancer by clearing out damaged cells before they can turn malignant. Final question, is it just a trend that's going to disappear? Definitely not. While the term might be trendy on social media, the biological process itself is fundamental to our health. As we learn more from those thousands of upcoming studies, the focus will likely shift from just fasting for autophagy to more nuanced, personalized approaches to support this vital cellular function. It's not a fad, it's foundational biology that we're finally beginning to understand and leverage for better health. So what's the biggest myth you've heard about autophagy or fasting? Drop it in the